I found narrating my novel, Breaking the Ice, to be a really enlightening and richly rewarding experience. And I think that it, it really complements a printed book to be able to listen to an author read her own work. Because, especially for Breaking the Ice, which was a very personal book for me, it enabled me to give the book some nuances that I hope the reader gets when they read the printed version, but you're not always sure. In, in reading the book, you're able to, like when you're, when you're doing two dialogue between two characters, you're able to give it that inflection, that cadence that you heard in your head when you were writing it. And sometimes that little bit of a nuance can add a, a, an extra dimension. And when you're writing an action sequence, you're very conscious as a writer in making your, sh your sentence structure shorter to ho hopefully sweep the reader along in that faster pace and really engage them in the story. And when you're reading it as an audiobook, you get to, to again, experience that same cadence that you heard in, the head, in your head to impart the kind of danger, to really immerse the reader in that action sequence. And this book in particular was welcome to be able to narrate because Alaska plays such a vital role, a, really a third character, if you will, in the book. So I'm very grateful to the wonderful women of Dog Ear Audio who really guided me through this process because it gave me a wonderful opportunity to bring something new to the story, um, to tell it in a different way, and to add some of the nuances that, that I, I really enjoyed uh, imparting to the listener reader. Um, it also gave me some really wonderful lessons, this whole project, that I will carry with me in future public appearances because I learned a lot about how tone of voice and um, diction and um, bringing emotion into dialogue and all of that, how much that can add to a story. So probably I will read a little slower at future public appearances and read a little differently and mark my script up a little better before I do it and, and hopefully that will add to a reader's enjoyment. Find out more about uh, Breaking the Ice, about the audiobook. You can go to dogearaudio.com and find out everything you want to know about the audiobook and probably see some pictures and video of me actually in the process of recording Breaking the Ice as an audiobook and uh, order the audiobook from there, of course. And visit my website at www.kimbaldwin.com and you can see um, my author notes on writing Breaking the Ice and pictures of my slideshow from my sled dog trip. I hope you'll go and give Breaking the Ice a listen.